today we've got a video um, on how to install a Goldwing window. We have one on the other side that we installed last year and we had a spare one so we thought well, why not get it installed on this side of the vehicle. We love how the one that we already have just opens up the space in the back of the car so much. It lets a lot more light in. Um, and also we've added the fridge back into the car now that we're getting into spring summer so we will be needing the fridge. We put it onto the other side of the vehicle where we currently have the golden window and it works really well being able to access the fridge from the outside of the vehicle and the inside of the vehicle. So we thought we'd get one installed on this side um, so we're going to take you through the process today. We're going to measure up the other side and transfer it to this side using masking tape to create the frame. check the lines and measurements compared to the goal wing on the other side. We're going to take a break, have a cup of tea and then come back and double check everything again just to make sure that everything's 100% right before we start cutting into the car. So now we're going to work out where the corner cut is going to be. To work this out, you're actually given the radius in the instruction manual when you get your goal wing window. So you want to draw out the frame um, with a 90 degree angle. So you're going from your corner and you're measuring back 61 mil and then that will be the end of your curve. And then again, you're going from the 90 degree angle again, back 61 mil and that's the end as well. So you can join these two lines together and that is the center of your circle. And anywhere that you measure back from the center of your circle will be 61 mil. So 61 mil, if you follow that all the way around, then join up the dots and create your curve. So essentially what you're creating is a quarter of the circle and that's how you're gonna get the corner curve of your golden window correct. To double check your measurements and also the curve in the corner, we cut out a template and we just use the glass from the window to actually create this template.
So the glass is in and the next part of the install process is to pop on the gas struts on the other side. So we're going to get started on that now. Garwing window install completed. We hope that you found this video interesting and if you've got any questions about how we completed the install then please let us know and we'll see you in the next one. Bye.